Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on MC Factories. So this is a really cool plugin that allows your players to create their own factories to produce whatever items they want. So here we have one example, this is producing diamonds and as you can see there is um, a few pieces of information on the side. So it's on and it's at 55% at the moment, when it gets to 100% it will make a diamond and this is the amount of power that we have given it. So if we check the back, this is the uh, chest that will have the produce. So here this is producing glass, which is very, very quick. And on the right we have the power chest. So as you can see here, this has uh, 48 power, this has over 100. So um, that's how you increase the speed of your factory. And you can choose whatever um, you want to produce but um, certain items take longer such as uh, diamond obviously takes a long time glass is very fast and yeah so the way to create it is you need a block of emerald and then a block of diamond on top like that stick a button on the emerald block and then pop a chest down on the left or the right and behind and then we just pop in a sign and this needs to be a factory on the top line uh, make sure I don't knock out my audio cable and then we uh, we can put the power in here there are lots of different power blocks uh, I'm just going to use diamonds because it's easier and then we are going to go into the factory by hitting the button and what do we want it to produce well let's go with uh, iron ingot so um, let me get rid of this we don't need it anymore we can see that this is the amount of power we have and this is the amount it requires to produce one. So glass, 1,200, not very much. Diamond, 40,000, so that's going to take a long time. It hasn't even got to one yet, which is pretty ridiculous. Uh, so I could actually add more, um, more of these. And as you can see, the power has gone up and we are now at 136.5 and this should go up a bit faster. So uh, let's have a look over here. We have only a few blocks here. It's at 48.8. And if we grab this and just spam it in, just get so many blocks in there, we will now have 136.5 and it will go up very, very, very quickly. Uh, same with this. So um, it's a really cool uh, plugin that you can download for free off of Spigot. There are a few, uh, a few things you can change in the config files. There's three files, I believe. Although you only really need to edit one. Um, so we are going to have a very quick look at that. Um, but let me just make sure this is, works. So as you can see, if we right click, we have now produced one iron. Uh, lots, of, lots of glass there. And one diamond finally. And then we'll obviously start again. So uh, it's a really interesting way of um, making new items. Um, and obviously we could change it to something else if we wanted to. So let's go to the config file now and show you how you can edit stuff in there. So here we are in the options.yml. Um, there are two other files. The factories.yml just saves information about your factories and we have the languages.yml uh, which has uh, the text. So um, we're going to go into the options.yml. This is the main file you want to edit. And right away we can see all of the different items and the power, money, and um, costs of everything. So uh, if we look at the diamond block, this is what we are using to produce power. It uh, produces 10. Um, and then we have, where is it, glass. This um, required 1,200, uh, which is really cool. You can change any of these, delete them, add to them. It just depends whatever you want. We then have the base power of a factory, which is 5, the power modifier, which is 0 0.5, and how many um, factories each player can have. So 5, uh, it was 1 by default, but I changed it so I could have a few more. But you wouldn't want to set this too high, otherwise players would just get so many diamonds and emeralds and obsidian and all that good stuff. And the block limit uh, per factory as well. So that is uh, everything in the options.yml, not too much in here, you can just um, add and remove different blocks if you wanted to, and then you could change the text as well. So uh, that is the plugin, as I mentioned before, it is free to download, and it's just something to make your server a bit different. Um, 
So yeah, hopefully I will upload more regular videos. Um, as you might have heard, my graphics card died, so I replaced it with a 1070, which is pretty beastly. Uh, I might upload a picture to Twitter or something, that's what I did before. Uh, so yeah, subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.